My name is Heather Foote, and I joined WOLA on September 11th uh, of 1978. Like Joe Eldridge, I was uh, in Chile uh, during the coup, although we didn't know each other. And I was when one of the many young people who watched, uh, in my case, over about 10 years, uh, the birth of the human rights debate within uh, Congress. I'm very, very excited about this 50th anniversary celebration that Carolina and her staff have organized because it's a reminder to me of what people can do when they're engaged in policy issues and when they have very powerful stories to tell. To me, the highlight for WOLA in those years um, from about 78 onwards was how many people from Latin America we hosted, we were enablers, so that they could come and tell their own stories to congressional staffers, sometimes to senators and representatives themselves. And that, to me, remains a hallmark of Vola's work, to not be the voice for other people necessarily, but really to be a conduit to enable uh, people who have experienced human rights violations, who are struggling for greater democratic practice to speak for themselves to those who are the policymakers in Washington.